I represent Canon North in this August Senate. Mr. President, I support this bill and I urge my colleagues to support this bill because anything that has to do with the establishment of a teaching hospital in any health institution in this country should be welcomed by all and sundry because that will help to close the gap in respect of the number of personnel we need to run our healthcare system in this country. As we speak, there's a very big gap. The number of personnel we have, they are not up to, not even up to half of the required number. So what you need to do is to train and train and teach and teach anyone who wants to be a healthcare delivery professional so that we can close this gap. And in particular, the request made by this bill is not only, it should be supported, it's appropriate, it's necessary because of the peculiar situation in Ademar State, which uh, has been uh, captured in the lead debate. They need the decision hospital. And apart from that, we spend a lot of money, Mr. President, in medical tourism in this country, every year. People traveling out of Nigeria to go and seek medical attention all over the world. The more we have this hospital, the more we have teaching hospitals, specialized hospital has been sought by this bill, the better, the more the merrier. So it's really important and I support, well, you see, it's good to commend Senator Aisha. Last week she brought a motion that has to do, that had to do with uh, the resuscitation of a moribund healthcare facility in a senatorial zone. Now she's bringing this. So she needs to be commended for taking the healthcare system of our people so important, just like any one of us here takes uh, the healthcare delivery system in his zone, uh, very important. So we need to support her and support the establishment of this uh, uh, teaching hospital, not only for the betterment of the people of Adama State, but for the betterment of the people of the entire Nigeria. I so submit this. Senator,